This is the bright line spectrum of water. And water, of course, is a compound made up of two different types of atoms, hydrogen and oxygen. And of course, the bright line spectrum should be a mixture of the two different spectral lines from hydrogen and oxygen, since each element has a unique arrangement of electrons and protons. Therefore, the energies associated with them are essentially going to be of the atoms. Now, if we look at the spectrum, it should be basically a composite mixture of both hydrogen and oxygen. Notice the red bright line to the right. That's really hydrogens coming through. And that double kind of blue line uh, to the left comes from the oxygen. So this is a mixture of both, as uh, we can see that hydrogen has both hydrogen and oxygen. So you can see how spectral line analysis helps us identify uh, the types of elements that are involved. And again, this is how we actually discovered helium from the sun. So in any case, water vapor has both hydrogen and oxygen spectral lines mixed in, although they'll be a little bit different because there is some bonding going on. So therefore, the lines want to be exactly the same as individual hydrogen and oxygen, but you get the idea.